Michelle Christensen began dreaming of space at five years old when her dad took her to the Kennedy Space Center during a family trip to Walt Disney World. Michelle said she was fascinated when her dad explained people went to the moon. She remembers looking up at a redstone rocket and marveling at the engine. Michelle followed her passion for figuring out how things worked through science camps, fairs, and academic contests. She first discovered Space Camp watching the show Double Dare, where the grand prize was a trip to Space Camp. She started saving money to pay her share of the trip across the country. Then finally, at 14, she boarded a plane full of excitement and anticipation. Michelle remembers getting to camp and meeting students from all over the world. She found people just like her at Space Camp, people who also marveled at rocket engines and dreamed of going to space. Michelle said, I always felt a little weird growing up. Meeting other people who had the same enthusiasm really helped push me forward. She returned to Space Camp in 11th grade and then joined the crew trainer team during a summer away from the University of Washington. A day here at Space Camp is a very long and packed day, especially once they get to Vent Space Academy. Uh, we wake them up somewhere around 7 o'clock in the morning and they will be continuously doing activities. She met fellow crew trainers who were students at the University of Alabama in Huntsville and she saw the great internships they had at the Marshall Space Flight Center. She stayed in Alabama taking Space Camp on the road in the Mission to Malls project until she qualified for in-state tuition. She often wonders what would have happened if she hadn't made that choice. After she earned her doctorate in mechanical engineering at Penn State, she landed a job at Blue Origin as one of only 160 employees. Today, Blue Origin has more than 1,000 people building Amazon founder Jeff Bezos' dream of rockets that launch into space and return safely to Earth, lowering the cost of spaceflight and opening the solar system to everyone. Michelle isn't looking up at rocket engines anymore. She's building them, leading a team of engineers working on the pre-burner phase of the BE-4 engine. At Blue, Michelle found the same kind of team she found at Space Camp, people like her working toward a common goal. When she's not at work, Michelle explores her creative side. I started making jewelry because I enjoyed how you could manipulate metals, she said. It's no surprise many of her pieces are inspired by space and the vehicles that send us there. With each jewelry sale, Michelle makes a donation to the Alumni Association's Drive to 35 scholarship effort. Her goal is to inspire the next generation of engineers and explorers.